Before I begin another set of Qigong movements, I wanted to just go back to basics. And I wanted to go back to the first posture that we use before every class and really before every set of Qigong movements that we do. And that is standing. So the first posture I'm going to show you today is a posture that is ordinarily sort of done in the military, right? Of feet together, arms down at the sides, lengthening through the top of the head. And I may say, I'm standing at attention. This is a really interesting posture, and it is it sort of calls something in the body very specific. But in Qigong, we do something a little different. We actually take the next posture that's told to a soldier in the army when the captain says, at ease, and you do this. This is what we do at the beginning of every class. We stand with feet hip width apart at ease. But our posture has a little bit, a little bit of detail there. We have actually the heels that have to go a little bit further out, so the toes are slightly in. And my arms are down at the side still. And I want to lengthen through the top of the head. So there's a kind of grounding in the lower part of the body and a kind of lengthening up all the way to heaven. So relating earth and the heavens. So you can see sort of what the difference is between this, which is one kind of posture, and this, and then with the heels a little bit out to the sides, but also relating the earth and the sky. So right now my, my arms are sort of hanging down at the sides, and we're going to do something a little bit different. We're going to use our stick about a 24 inch long stick. And I'm going to put it right in the center of my palms. And I'm going to let the arms just hang down. Nothing special. Elbows relaxed. Everything relaxed. But now we're going to actually lengthen through our fingers. And there's going to be a little bit of pressure at the palms, the elbows slightly bent, and then a little bit of opening underneath the arms. So I relax, and then lengthening, and something in the lungs actually kind of expands. So I breathe in, and then I relax, and then a little lengthening of the fingers, pressure of the palms. I lengthen through my the upper part of my body, the stable base below. So I can actually put my stick down and have the same experience right through lengthening of the fingers and then opening underneath the arms. And then relaxing. And then lengthening. So standing can be a kind of freedom. And allowing something really to expand and lengthen in its 
in itself a whole practice and it's where I begin every movement. <laughs>